This video will demonstrate how to upload a video into the Bongo Video Assignment Tool in Talon. And this video is specifically for students. So you'll find your video assignment tool under course content. And then your instructor will have put it in one of the modules. You'll need to know which module it's in. For this class, we're gonna find it under the CAT Presentations module. So I'm gonna find it here. Um, it is gonna show as an external learning tool, which is completely normal. It's not really an external learning tool. It's still built into Talon, but since it is third-party software powered by Bongo Learning built into Talon, it does demonstrate as an external learning tool here. So I'm gonna click on that. And from here, I can upload my video. So I'm going to click this Add button. And it may be tempting to click on File, but you actually don't want to click on File here. You want to click on Video to upload a video if you've recorded the video on your phone. File would be for something like a document, like a PDF or a doc file. But you want to click on Video if you're uploading the video file directly from your phone or recording device. There's also a link option here. The link option could be used if you uploaded your video to YouTube and you just wanted to provide a link. But if you wanna upload directly into Bongo, you're gonna click the video. So that's what I'm gonna do here. And there is an option to record. I would not recommend using this at this time. I would just go ahead and click the upload. Okay, and then here I'm gonna say click here to have it open up. And it's going to open up my files and I am going to find, I'm pretty sure it's in downloads. There's my cat video. So I'm going to open that. It's going to take a few minutes to upload. So the first thing I need to do here is click where it says begin upload. I can see it's about 18 megabytes. So depending on how fast my internet speed is, this could take a long time if you have a big file or it may take just a few minutes, but you do have to be a little bit patient here. Okay, then it's going to take a couple minutes to process this video. So, and that's, this is the part that's easily missed. When it's done processing, you're going to need to click this star. So, to wait for it to process here, I'm going to go ahead and just refresh this page. We'll see. Oh, looks like it's done. Fantastic. Okay, this is the step that's really easily missed for students. It's really tempting to just stop right here, but notice it's not submitted yet. So it says down here, you have to click the star when you're ready to include it in your submission. So I'm going to click the star button, and now it's telling me my assignment is not submitted yet. Now I can come down here though, now that it's starred, now I can click submit. It's going to say, are you sure do you want to submit this assignment? And you can say yes. Now from here, I can come back in here and I can view uh, peer reviews. If I see other student speeches up here, I can um, find them on a drop down menu and it'll tell me how many of these looks like for here. I need to do three or so I would see one, two, three, how many of these I've done. And I can come down here and I can watch my submission. And I can even add comments in here that would go to my instructor. And I can come back in here then and view this and I can view my instructor's comments and also the peer feedback I get from other students. So that is a brief overview of using the video assignment tool built into Talent.